afternoon class myself abhishek yadav from cs department going to deliver a presentation on software engineering okay so first of all what is software engineering okay the term se software engineering is composed of two words software and engineering first of all what is software it is more than just a program code a program is an executable code it could be a executable code which serve some computational purpose software is considered to be a collection of executable programming code associated libraries and documentation software when made for a specific requirement some requirement is known as software product and what is engineering engineering on the other on the other hand it is all about developing product using well defined scientific principles and methods so here by combining this these definitions we can define se software engineering as an engineering branch associated with the development of software product using well defined scientific principles methods and procedures okay according to ieee definition what could be the ieee definition it is the application of a systematic discipline disciplined approach to the development of operation and maintenance of a good software development okay in our next slide it consists of what could be the principles of se principles of software engineering okay without using se principles is too difficult is too difficult to develop a large program in industry it is usually needed large programs to facilitate multiple functions a problem with developing such large commercial program is that the complexity and it could be the difficulty level of the programs se helps to reduce programming complexity it is generally it could be uh, shown as by the help of two methods that are abstraction and decomposition what is what is the abstraction the abstraction principle implies that a problem can be simplified simplified by the by omitting irrelevant things means to uh, to omit to or modify the irrelevant data and to use only or go through only with the particular specific data relevant data this is property is known as abstraction and what is the decomposition decomposition in this method a complex pro problem a large problem it is divided into several smallest programs and smallest units and the smallest programs are always easier to solve one by one so these could be the principles is it this these two points could be the best 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 example to produce the principles of se so software engineering next is what could be the need of se what is the need of se we can we can see in many terms there are many points where we can see the need of se here we have mentioned only five points that is first is large software okay in the large software what is the meaning of this term it is easier to build a wall than to a house or building likewise as the size of software become large engineering has to step to give it as a scientific process okay next is scalability in the software process were not based on scientific and engineering concept it would be easier to recreate new software than to scale an existing one it could be the other need of se other thing is cost as hardware industry has shown its skills and huge manufacturing has lowered down the prices of computer and electronic hardware but the cost of but the cost of this software remains high and proper process is not adapted so this could be a important need of se next is next need could be its dynamic nature what is the dynamic nature 
the always growing and adapting nature of software hugely depends upon the environment in which the user works if the nature of software is always changing new enhancement need to be done in the existing one this is the where software engineering plays a best role this so this nature is known as its dynamic property or dynamic nature our next is uh, need is quality management what is the quality management what could be the point better process of software development provides better and quality software product so these these uh, these were the points in need of software engineering next is a characteristics some characteristics of a good software we all want to create a soft not so soft, uh, not a software but we want to create a good software best software so what should be the characteristics of good software in terms a software product can be just by what it offers and how well it can be it can be used this software must satisfy on the following grounds ground levels means on some specific some specific concern we can we can guess what could be the characteristics of a good software in terms of operational it in terms of transitional in terms of maintenance okay now now in terms of operational it if we have to explain if we want to know the characteristics in terms of operational these there are some points according to which we can say that it is it is a good software in terms of operational the points could be budget usability efficiency correctness functionality dependability security safety these are some points regarding operational which combines to give produce characteristics of a nice yeah best software okay our next term could be transitional this aspect is important when the software is moved from one platform to another because it's known it's its name is transitional here so what could be the points first point it could be portability next is interoperability next is its reusability its property of last adaptability so there these are the points in transitional next in next is maintenance so in maintenance what is the meaning of maintenance this aspect this aspect briefs about how well a software has the capabilities to maintain itself in the ever changing environment so here are some points modularity maintainability flexibility scalability so these were some points in terms of operational transitional and maintenance our next slide is goal of software engineering what could be the goal of software engineering so the the primary goals of se software engineering are to 